This is an example of how you can use your Arduino with a switch controller and a 8x8 LED matrix. The components we will need in this project are a Arduino, type doesn't really matter, a switch controller, in this case MAX7219, a ceramic capacitor, a 8x8 LED matrix, and 8 220 resistors and one 10k resistor. The first thing I want to talk about is how the switch controller is connected to the LED matrix. On the top side of the switch controller you see these eight wires. These are connected four on the top and four on the bottom to the LED matrix. Uh, these controls the rows of light. Uh, the first one controls the first row, the second one controls the second row, and the bottom first controls the first row and so on. I have connected a 220 resistor. Uh, this is as a safety precaution. Uh, the reason why is because this might actually work without the resistor, but after a while you might actually end up burning out your light, LED lights in the matrix. On the bottom side you see these eight wires. Uh, four orange and four yellow ones. These are connected to the bottom of the matrix which will give a green light. If they were connected to the top, they will actually give a red light. This is because I'm using a 24 pin LED matrix with uh, the colors green and red. This controls the column lights on the matrix. The next thing I want to talk about is how the other Lino is connected to the board. On the bottom side you see these two wires, one red and one black. The black one is ground, the red one is 5 volts. Uh, these two black wires are connected to ground from the switch controller and these two red wires are connected to 5 volts. This is a 10k resistor. This has to be minimum 10k. You can go higher. On the board you see these three wires. Uh, these are connected to the switch controller. This first one, the blue one, is the data pin. The second one is the leech pin. And the uh, third one is the cloak pin. Uh, the slots on the board doesn't really matter. This is determined by your own code. The last thing I want to mention is a problem I ha had with the matrix. When all the lights were connected, I would get this kind of flickering. Uh, and the way I sold that was to connect a ceramic capacitor to my project. Now that I have explained the setup for the Adrenalino and the matrix with the switch controller, I will now show you a video of a working prototype. Uh, the code for this example will be found in the description with the library to run the switch controller. So, thank you for watching.